You can get an extra jolt from a lot more than just coffee these days. Our caffeine crazed culture is getting bigger doses in some foods and drinks you may not suspect. Uh, but tonight, ABC 3340 Cynthia Gould with the health warning you may not even know to look for. This lemonade has 400 milligrams of caffeine in it. 400. Are you hitting me? These charged lemonades at Panera Bread promise to give you an instant energy boost. Tomsi has never, ever been happier. That blows my mind, absolutely, yeah. It is listed on the sign on the fountains, and if you look closely on the website, the caffeine content is there. But to the unsuspecting customer or to a child, it could be a real jolt. Health professionals are concerned we're getting too much caffeine. Not only in drinks, it comes in a, a chewing gum formulation. It comes in powders different foods. Chocolate has caffeine. These caffeinated snack bars equal a cup of espresso. The FDA does not, you know, regulate the amount of caffeine. They do um, ask that different companies are honest in their labeling of caffeine. Doctors say it's okay for adults to have up to 400 milligrams of caffeine a day. That's four to five cups of coffee. And it all depends upon your tolerance. 12 to 18 year olds should have less than 100 milligrams. That's about one cup of regular coffee. The American Academy of Pediatrics says no caffeine is recommended for children under 12. That means no coffee, caffeinated drinks like soda or sports drinks, which can and have 250 milligrams of caffeine. The caffeine increases your heart rate, uh, causes constriction of the vessels, makes your heart work harder, your heart needs more oxygen. It's certainly not good for the kids and their hearts. Poison information centers get calls from worried parents. The symptoms in pediatrics are similar to adults. That includes insomnia, restlessness, high heart rate, heart palpitations, nausea, and vomiting. Becky DeVore says their staff can help determine if your child needs a trip to the ER. They will need, you know, to be on a monitor um, and to have an EKG, of course. But caffeine is a stimulant, so it can increase all vital signs. The market for energy drinks is also growing every year with caffeine content topping 200 to 300 milligrams. Most of the people my age I know drink energy drinks on a daily basis over coffee. And here are just a few examples of the popular energy drinks with lots of caffeine. Red Bull, 151 milligrams. Rockstar here, 240. Bang, 300. Starbucks Triple Shot, 225. And Monster, 150 milligrams. So always check those labels carefully. Sometimes they are very hard to read.